It's your boy, Evan, back playing Fallout New Vegas. I know if you'll do my video quality, it might suck, but shut up, deal with it. When we last left off, we, were, we just finished the tutorial, and do not question the noise, just don't worry about it. We are now, of course, doing whatever we feel like for some odd reason. Now, of course, I think we know where to go. What's that? Is that a fridge? If you don't get this reference, it's from Indiana Jones. Taking that hat, we're gonna replace it with our hat. We're gonna repair, we're gonna wear this hat and see the difference. The exact same thing. Wait, I think one's lower than the other. Yeah, one's lower than the other. I don't know, maybe. Like, yeah, we'll wear the lower one. Well, time for knife, knife. Where we are lifting off, we might just. I'm just saying, screw you, Good Springs. You suck. Thanks for helping me, but screw you. I don't need that charity. Right now, we're walking over to that place called to the big roller coaster because I can. Jeans Prim in Las Vegas. Let me just, um, good enough. Well, since I'm here, I might just check it out. By the way, I'm, and by the way, listen to me carefully. Well, I've discovered areas. Neat. And by the way, listen to me carefully. I'm not playing this with mods because, uh, because I'm playing this on the PlayStation. Well, let's start looting. Empty. Average empty. Yeah. Oh, blue star. Key. Yeah, sure. Nah. Uh, sure, why not? Plasma pistol? Sure, why not? Alright. Well, this place had no meaning. Well, this place sucks. Let's continue going. Wait, how's our pre-war building? Is that a plane? Let's keep walking. Da 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 do do. I'm not gonna play this with music on because of one simple reason: copyright. Everybody knows it. Everybody hates it. We all know it. So let's keep walking. What's that thing? So let's, grab some, let's grab some stuff that I've found on the road. Because that's clearly healthy. Somehow. Prim and Los Angeles? In, in Nippleton. Huh. Los Angeles and Nippleton. Hotel gas and smile. Huh. Nippleton. I love Nippleton. I think it's called Nipton. Where are these? Alright. Knife. Time to knife. Knife to meet you. Who are you? Hey, where the hell do you think you're going? Prim is off limits. What's going on at Prim? Some convicts from the prison up the road have taken over the town. Everyone inside is either dead or in hiding. What's more, there are two tribes of raiders causing trouble in this area as well. 
you'd be safer heading back up to Good Springs. Shouldn't you be protecting the town or something? We'd love to. They don't fall under NCR jurisdiction. Even if they did, we're in no shape to protect them. Why can't you protect them like with your stupid cat and goggles? equipment to take out the convicts. And even if we did, we need some extra hands for backup. You should talk to Lieutenant Hayes. He's in a tent down the road. Just stay on the west side of the overpass if you don't want to get shot. Which is the west side of the overpass? But we won't get shot because we are too awesome to die. Isn't that isn't that right, people who are who actually care enough to watch? Yeah. No, we're going around. Uh. I'm just gonna walk around. Hey, dude, you suck. I'm too cool for this place. Maybe bed might be nice, but no, too awesome. Remember, very sharp knife, very awesome knuckle. Yeah, feels good to be a gangster. I'm gonna stab you. I'm gonna stab you. You and your stupid face. Not yet, though. Because I might need you for some odd reason. That's a mine. I think that these could help be helpful later. Huh. Oh, that, that building looks familiar. Yeah, I uh, would the courier. Time to knife. Oh no, mercenary type of people. Oh no, <gasps> I want your hat. I'm taking that cowboy hat. This, I'm taking whatever you have. To wear your hat. No it. Yeah. We look stupid. We don't keep wearing this um hat. Cause this hat's awesome. That's dank. What's on this building? Wait. Let's go in here first. I don't know what it was brought you to Prim, youngster, but you might want to rethink your plans. Town's gone to hell. No dur. Who are you? Johnson Nash is my name. Husband to Ruby. Lived in Prim going on eight years now. Thinking thing. I'm a trader primarily. What it's worth, things like they are. I also run the local Mojave Express outpost. I'm a curry with the Mojave Express. Well, I don't got any work right now, so I'm sleep. I lost the package I was supposed to deliver. I'll tell you whatever I can. You have a delivery order, you can show me. Yeah, sure. Oh. That job had strange written all over, but we couldn't turn down the caps. I was strange about it. Some men stole the package, a man chicken soup, and some thugs. Do you, did they pass this way? Well, now that you mentioned it, a few nights back, one of the townies was out scavenging for supplies. He said he saw a fellow with a daisy suit come through with some of them great con misfits. They was talking about a chip. One of those men shot me. I need to know the best way to get to them. Well, for that, your best bet is going to be talking to Deputy Bagel. Bagel? Since they came to town, he was keeping a good bit of notes on him. And he was slinking around by some speed when your pretty boy friend came. He may have heard where they were going. I'll show you about it. That 
cowboy robot had us hire six couriers. Each was carrying something a little different. A pair of dice, a chest piece, that kind of stuff. Last word I had from the office, it looked like payment had been received for the other five jobs. Guess it was just your chip that didn't make it. First deputy we hired to do the job, canceled. Hope a storm from the divide skins him alive. Well, that's where you can. He canceled? Yeah, I got this look when he saw you next down the courier. His expression turned right around. Asked me if your name was for real. I said, sure as lack of rain, he was still kicking. Then he turned down the job, just like that. I asked if he was sure if it was good money. No, but courier six carried back. That's what he said. Like the Mojave to sort you out or something. Then he just up and walked out. You know where he was, where he went? No idea. Sounds like you two had a history for him to act like that. He turned down the money, too. Hope he didn't see any trouble in that package of yours. Maybe he thought your name was bad luck. Not for me to say. How are you? Do you mean the one over there? Nope. Different fellow. Bigger. Had himself a face on the screen. And he talked more like you and me. I just, uh, think my... Don't go. Yeah. And this ought to be the right time to add to this. Oh. I, I can't take the risk of copyright. Do you risk copyright? I wouldn't. Hello there. What brings you to Prim? Food. <laughs> Let's go outside and stab. Dean, Domino, um, Tops, 25, um, Pin, Coins, Money, Screw You. And the gold sight. Oh, it can be. Okay, I think I know the best way for a king. A stabby stab. See, infinite, infinite couples death car. Nah, I'd rather this on Rondo. Scream, something else. Rice is an idea from the point. I'm gonna take the gun and put like, everything you have for just no apparent reason. Because I'm that type of a psychopath. Ah! Hello. Uh. Uh. So I would take some money, bottle cap, dynamite, stem pack, burn and rifle, tire item. Now let's do something that I can do. Let's fix some um, cleavers. Let's fix some nine millimeters. Which are good to Berman rifles. And we're good to move on. Oh, that's cute. And just like that, um, I just killed a whole population. Ooh. Yeah, let's bring up some points on science. 
So let's give up Lady Killer. So I'll take the money and uh, ammo. And that's really all that matters, money and ammo. What's this? Incinerator, sure, why not? I take your leather armor and your fuel. Oh, there is the leather armor. Look. Yep, this is my new armor. Better. Let's see. Sleep. Sleep. Sleep in a room full of dead people. Woo. Who are you? Oh, you're Deputy Bagel. I don't suppose you came here to rescue me. I'd cross my fingers, but my hands are numb. You must be Be Deputy Bagel. Why, yes, I am. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm in a bit of a predicament here. I'd be most appreciative if you'd set me free. I have some information that may come to him to me. You gotta take a seat. Indeed, I do, good sir. And I would be thrilled to share that information with you as soon as I am released from captivity. Alright, so you stay down. Oh, that's just marvelous. I think I'll be making my way outside now. The air is a little close in here. Time, if you try to run and set or finding out my side, I'll kill you myself. Oh, why, uh, of course. I'll never let you fight my kidnappers with my help, but without it. You lead the way. Okay, we're leaving now. There's nothing here for us. It's all right, I think I saw Big Spoon. We're keeping this. Well, if you don't understand the meaning of that, um, deal with it. I one time tried to um, kill someone with a spoon. It was um, sad. Here, let's just take, let's take, let's take all the money. Uh, the register money. Let's see what they have. Is there anything more? Teddy bear. Teddy bear. Teddy bear and I'll just take one bottle. Who are you? All right, your deputy bagel. Let's go. Well, that was a fairly easy job. Now let's go to Vicky and Vance. Hey, hey. Well, that was quite an adventure. We taught those convicts a thing or two, didn't we? Yeah, we taught Breaking them. Breaking myself out of a hostage situation. Not to diminish your role in it, of course, but it was quite thrilling. Problem is, there's still no law in print. What are we to do the next time ruffians menace us and hold us hostage? Tell me about the man check and see who came through. Ah, yes. My memory is much clearer now that I'm free from my bondage. I was uh, performing recon, gathering information on some of the powder gangers, when some great cons arrived with your friend in the suit. They were talking about some delivery they took from a courier. I assume that was you. They said they'd be heading through Nipton to <coughs> the contact there. Oh, to, Nip to Nippleton to Novik. Well, I guess I could help this town. Hello again. I don't suppose. Not sure why not. Where's the sheriff now? Oh, no. I'm just a deputy. And I can't be a deputy without a sheriff. It's called chain of command. But there is no sheriff. The sheriff's dead. I killed him. <laughs> I don't have. I'll bring the law back to prune. That's just marvelous. I'll start thinking up questions for the interview. The sheriff that was incarcerated up at NCRCF may be a good choice. You also may be able to convince that NCR guy across the road to take the town under his wing. Although martial law doesn't sound so fun. Uh, we'll let Prim be in the pan the yeah, ass for that. I also talk to that guy over there. On night, I'm mugging. But I just charged into this place and I just took over. You guys have weapons. I have a knife. 
you guys are you guys this army is useless. No wonder the Legion lost. And I'm here to talk to the guy that he is here for like right. Big boy. Yeah, we're just gonna talk we're just gonna let them take over the town. Cause that seems the easiest. I'm Sergeant McGee of the New California Republic Army Battalion First Company. It's your you wanna voice, talk about something to Lieutenant Hayes? Where are you from? I'm from the hub originally, but it's been a long time since I saw it. I'm on my second tour here. Most non commissioned officers are. Goodbye. Sir. Time to night. Now I'm not going to kill Sergeant Mickey. Sergeant Mickey, run. Run where I still can. I'm about to kill you later. Good evening. I'm Lieutenant Hayes of the New California Republic Army 5th Battalion 1st Company. What's your business? I want your hat. Prim needs a dire law. We know Prim is a great strategic and we aren't blind to the needs of the town, but we're barely holding our own against the powder gangers. Powder rangers? We don't have the guns or the personnel needed to carry out our mission, much less take on defending this town as well. What we need more than anything is bodies. If we had just one more squad, we could easily install a sheriff and still handle our primary objective of protecting the interstate south of here. If you'd like to see the NCR include protection of Prim and its duties, then you'll have to get some more troops up here. Night at Mojave Outpost may be able to help. Oh, you are. You suck. So I'm gonna kill you or later? Hmm. Maybe later. Hello. Mickey's nice. He said hello without stabbing me in the face or in the hip or anywhere. Well, to that statue thingy. Went on the road again. Never know, no, 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 that you do, you do that. What's this thing? Feel free to skip ahead. Who's shooting at me? Think this tumbleweed. Let's go tumbleweed. Stop shooting me! I'm an innocent little boy. No, 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 no. Do I need to just crash? Well, this is where this episode is gonna end. Oh, my game crashing. But that's the. Well, if you enjoyed this video, uh, please like and subscribe and share it to your friends. This is, and as always, this is your boy, leaving out.